Another payoff. Walked him. Oh, call strike three. Are you kidding me? One down. Somebody got tossed. Joe got thrown out. I mean, the entire uh, entire game, it's been a bad strike zone on both sides. Alfonso Marquez is the crew chief who came in from second base. Joe's been ejected second time on this road trip. Location of that pitch. Tony knows the strike zone pretty well as a pitcher and a hitter, and he knows that's not in the strike zone. So he's going slider. That one he did not go either. See, no, he did. Joe Madden can't believe it. Let's see this time again. Yeah, he went. Lance Barrett is just ejected. Either Joe Madden or somebody else from the dugout. Joe's coming out. Usually when umpire says no more, the next peep, whoever it is, is gone. More? You know more? He's just, yeah. I think because of, you mentioned the way he says, no, he didn't go twice now. And they both all, and the whole bench went. He went. Kicks and deals 2-1, and Muncie looks at strike two. Last at bat, Max struck out on a splitter down there, slightly below the strike zone. But Dave Roberts and Mark Ripperger. Dave Roberts has been thrown out of the game. First time this season, Roberts has been ejected. Going to get his money's worth before heading back into the clubhouse. Swings and misses. He's muttering to himself, and he just got thrown out. And now he throws his bat away, and he's getting into the grill of Mark Ripperger. Well, all he did was he didn't make a comment. He just blurted out a word. And uh, you guys are real sensitive. And you know, I think back to uh, what I heard a manager say a number of years ago. We never questioned his eyesight. But we found out he has 20-20 hearing. So Muncie's been thrown out. Roberts has been thrown out. The Dodgers, with the uh, heavily packed bullpen, have but three bench play in the third, and Walker in the fourth. Is it Marte in the fifth? Yeah, that's that's a home run in a silo. <laughs> Will it drop in? Nope, Toppy is there. And Calhoun back at the bag at first, out number two. Now it kicks away for Murphy. Cole going to go to second. Now they got him hung up. Walters was backing up the play and did a tremendous <laughs> job, and they dropped the ball. McMahon couldn't handle it. They had Cole Calhoun dead to rights. He stuck his head in front of it. <laughs> Torrey's hot. He is really hot with the first base umpire. Calhoun's not arguing at all. He's just walking back to the dugout. And Torrey's not long for this game. He's gone. He's just been tossed. So Torrey Lavello has been tossed from the ball game. Walters, look at the job Walters does backing up the play. Calhoun sees that. Now they got him dead to rights. The throw to McMahon hits him right in the helmet. I don't see anything illegal about that. It didn't look to me like he tried to stick his head in front of the ball. It just hit him in the head. He's looking the whole way. Yeah, he put he, his he, helmet right he, there. He put his helmet into the to the baseball on the throw. He's tossing the ball game. Well, I mean, he's trying to get himself in a rundown, right? But the ball was thrown right at his at his helmet. Well, he's a heady player. That's the end of the fifth inning. Two, did he go? Oh, close. On a check down there at first, and one of the Rays, Rays uh, really wanted that call. Oh, Dwayne, if he hits the ball, it goes for a double. Yeah, the Rays are hot over that, and then we're going to have an ejection. 
Todd Tishner has just ejected Kevin Cash. And boy, uh, that is a big pitch. It's the end of the inning. Yep. And he went. It was clear as day. Everybody saw it except for the two, uh, you know, making the final decision. And here it is again. Breaking ball down. A great pitch executed well. Strike three. Mm -hmm. Some. We've got some conversation going on between the plate umpire James Hoy and the Marlins dugout. He may have thrown Don Mattingly out of the game. Yeah, he just threw somebody out. I think it was Donnie. And now Donnie's going to come get his money's worth. He is not a happy camper. This is three series worth of frustration with this crew boiling over. Yes. And uh, I think this has to do with balls and strikes. And other things. And remember you had to play with flowers right at home plate. That was Hoy's call initially. Yep. So time out here while Donnie mask on. Plate umpire has a mask on as well. Donnie gets his say with James Hoy. And James Hoy trying to get the last word in. That brought Donnie back for more. And uh, so. Donnie is really hot. And and he's 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 making his points with James Hoy the plate umpire and now the crew chief Mark Carlson has come in and uh, Donnie continues to make whatever points he wants to make with this umpiring crew. 10 3 3 score. He struck him out slider at the top of the zone. And Gonzalez, you can't argue balls and strikes. He did, and he's gone. Oh, that was the dugout that got that call. Brandon Hyden, whoever's talking in the Orioles dugout about the 2 0 changeup that was a strike, got the 3 1 curveball called a strike. Oh, he's going to punch out Soto on a fastball off the plate. Here's Chance Cisco. He just fouled one off. Scherzer trying to bring, bring the curveball around through the back door. Now we're going to have more going on here. Yeah, I think Kevin Long got thrown out there. Probably looked at the strike three to Juan Soto. And I think he said that was two balls inside and you called it strike three. Yeah, someone's gone. I think it was Kevin Long. You know what generally happens in these cases, Carp? I don't know a lot about Will Little strike zone, but those guys do. And when you start seeing misses, and you've seen them before with a certain guy. Do we have another pitcher from the stands thrown out in the same week? Is he going sacrificial lamb here? And it was Strasburg the day before his start. And Ani Ball is scheduled to start tomorrow Boy. in Atlanta. You get a lot of way. You get away with a lot of things wearing a mask, can't you? That wasn't me. It was him. Contact here. I think he went. He did. Call made by Tim Timmons. That's the first out. And strikeout number seven. And oh, did he get thrown out I of the game? Did. I he think did. he did. So Willie slammed his bat into the dirt, and Tim Timmons just threw him out of the game. And that's going to be it for Carrasco, it appears. You know, Rossi trying to make the case. Hey, Mike, he's frustrated. Let him express his frustration. Wonder if David, is this Rossi's first career uh, on-field argument? On-field might dispute. be. Yeah. yeah, it looked like a swing. I'm sure Wilson said, "Ask for help," and that may led to his for yeah. So it was the argument, and then the slam. Oh, wow. Oh, there's look. nothing up. There's nothing down. Jan Gomes hasn't thrown the ball back yet. Well, ejection taking place. Davey's been ejected at City Field before. And who are they ejecting? The skipper? And Steven Strasburg got thrown out? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, I love it. They kicked the fan out of the game. The World Series MVP. Between innings, Matt Shoemaker's frustration boiled over, and he was tossed from the game by Vic Carapaza, evidently for saying something from the dugout. And then after that, and we'll show you this momentarily, charged out of the dugout onto the field and had to be restrained. Now Charlie Montoyo and a few other players were out there. Yeah, and he was very upset by the call he didn't get, and then Carapaza threw him out of the game, and now Charlie Montoya is trying to hold him back. Pete Walker's there as well, and his teammates come out. As we mentioned, Matt Shoemaker is a guy that pretty much keeps in control of his emotions, and now Stu Shearwater comes over to talk to Charlie Montoya, and Shearwater's been around the Blue Jays a lot going back to summer camp, but Matt Shoemaker made a pitch he thought was strike three to Yoshi Sutsugo, and then he gives up a three-run home run, and his emotions boiled over. He got ejected from the dugout, and then once he realized he was ejected, he came storming out to voice his thoughts. And Charlie Montoyo, he comes out and talks to Carapaz, and then he gets thrown out of comes. Oh, strike three called. Santana down looking to away. Danny's probably going to get tossed, and he does. He wasn't happy with his last at bat when he struck out looking and had some words to say to Alfonso Marquez. And now Chris Woodward's going to have to go out and talk to Marquez. I don't know. This one, this one's pretty close. That was close. I think and Danny, not the first confrontation Danny's had tonight. That was on, it's that was you know it's interesting because where pitch cast had it, but then also where we see Hedges catch it. So you know it looks like a ball maybe where he catches it, but because you have an, a sidearm lefty coming from that angle and it's about where the ball crosses the plate. That's borderline. Danny ejected. Base is still loaded. Opportunity still exists here. Series with Kristen Stewart no. in left field. That's that's not that's playable. Agreed. That rule that is not a proper call. Carter's going to get thrown out if they don't reverse it. That ball just bounced out in their head. If it gets lodged in the ivy or something, it's different. Didn't even. What's the big deal? It's, it's free. Picked it right up. It didn't bounce out. Didn't raise his hands. Played it as if it were live. It was live. Look at they're telling him to settle down. I'm telling you, he's not going to stick around. That's a bad call. It is a bad call. They just told him to shut up. Look. Oh, now he's out. He just got tossed. That'd make me mad, too. I'm mad. I'm an, I'm an analyst. Good, good play by Hernandez. You think he put his arm, uh, arms up. Here's the pitch from Perez. Swung on, ground ball up the middle. Hernandez to the back for one, over to first, double play. Second ejection of the day for Detroit. It's Cameron Maben. He was tossed by home plate umpire DJ Rayburn. Some jawing going on with Votto and Shane Leibensparger. The home plate umpire, David Bell out there as well. Crew chief Tim Timmons trying to stay in between and Votto has been thrown out of the game. And now David Bell. Sticking up for his player getting his money's worth. They let him go for a while and he has been tossed as well. So frustration boiling over for this Reds team which not much has gone right tonight or of late. Certainly a tough night for Votto and we don't have, we don't have to tell you how tough of a 2020 it's been for David Bell, and he is getting his money's worth. Here's Votto coming out. 
He ran to his position initially, and then words were exchanged. And again, we're working off of monitors from far away, so we're trying to give you the best sequence we can of what happened. In the end, Votto has been tossed out of the game. Kyle Farmer is your new first baseman. David Bell has been ejected from this game. 